I'm Lynn Downey, Levi Strauss and Company historian, and I'm here in our Soho store in New York City with a fabulous selection of women's jeans from the company's archives. We're celebrating the 75th anniversary of the creation of women's jeans by Levi Strauss and Company. In 1934, Levi Strauss and Co. created Lady Levi's, lot 701. You'll remember the men's were lot 501. And we wanted to create a woman's jean that would be something that, that women would want to wear because women had been wearing men's jeans, the men's 501 jeans for a while. So what we decided to do was give them something that was a softer weave, something that was pre-washed with a little more feminine cut. And this is an example from the archives of the very first Lady Levi's. This pair is from about 1937. It's a little bit of a high waist, um, a little bit wide in the hips also, but still has the wide leg just like the men's jeans do. We wanted to give a feminine flair with the original sort of masculine attributes of the 501. So it's got the buckle back on the back, the way to adjust the pants perfectly. It even has a button fly, just like the 501. And it was still um, a 10 ounce fabric, but it was much softer. And this is what the kind of jean that women would wear. They would buy them here in New York City. They would wear them out west at a dude ranch, take them home to New York, and never wear them again because you could not wear denim on the street in New York City in the 1930s. So denim was really liberating for women. They could wear on a dude ranch. They could really feel free. And we actually know the name of the woman who owned these jeans. Her name was Harriet Atwood. She put her label inside the waistband on top of the store label. She wore them at the Soda Springs Dude Ranch in Rimrock, Arizona in the 1930s and for some reason left them behind and I bought them when the effects of the old Dude Ranch came up for sale. I bought them for our company archives. The thing that I always hear from people is, oh my gosh, I had no idea that you made jeans for so long or that you even made this kind of jeans. It's always a really fun educational experience to be able to talk to people and have them um, really understand that Levi's not only invented the first men's jean, but re invented the first women's jean. The big thing right now that Levi's is offering our consumers, of course, is the skinny fit. And because we've been making jeans for 75 years, of course, we, know, we have always known what women want. And in 1964, we did offer a skinny fit in Lady Levi's. They were specifically for juniors. This pair still has the tag on it, the long, lean Levi's look. It's very much a skinny jean compared to the, the wider leg original Lady Levi's. So this is the original skinny. It's literally from 1964. And we even started using stretch in our jeans in the 1960s. We put a little bit of DuPont nylon into our jeans. And so this was the, really the, uh, this is the, the mom, the, 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 the mother of, the, of today's skinny jeans, Lady Levi's for juniors. Well, the 60s were all about a skinny for junior girls, but by the early to mid 70s, it was all about flair. And we made so many flares for junior girls in the 1970s. Here's a great example. And we even did this pin tucking at the factory. This is the style as it came off the shelf for the consumer and probably in about 1975, 1976. So this really represents um, teenage girlhood in the 1970s. So these are all from the archives in San Francisco. It like represents thing. 75 years of Levi's uh, women's jeans. Wow. So those are, the, those are the 70s all the way up to 1937. So. Yeah. Skinny wow. from the 60s. World War II and Dude Ranch era 1930s. I love doing this. I love to talk to people about our history because I always, there's always someone or usually more than one someone that I connect with who really, who really loves the whole sense of, you know, the power of denim in American culture. And that's what I get to talk to people about. It's great. Th these are from my Oh yeah, these are all originals from our company archives oh, in San they Francisco. they been worn? Oh yeah, yes. these are worn. These belong to they a... They still look great. I know. That's the quality of Levi's jeans. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hoping what people will really be interested in is the jeans from 1934 um, because people won't really understand um, how long we've been making vintage denim. And then I, what I'm hoping as well is for people to see really how contemporary a lot of these looks are because so many of these are brought forward today. In fact, this really, the, the Lady Levi's from the 1930s could really be seen to be the, you know, the grandmother of the boyfriend fit today. You know, the button fly sort of oversized boyfriend fit. So what you're seeing here is, just, is the DNA of today's jeans for women.